Baton Rouge. When we call for 911, it's because we're in need of help from a first responder, but now we are seeing that they are the ones in crisis. Fox 44's Jacqueline Kissick tells us how this group of workers is trying to recruit more heroes. Between crime rising and patients overflowing hospitals, the shortage of first responders has become a crisis. I wish more people would get involved with this. Many first responders are seeing a low number of applicants. It does get taxing after a while. You know, we want to make sure that we fill those vacant spots. They needed to come up with a solution. All these young men and women today are more social media inclined. Uh, and we just, of course, we're going to change the various ways we reach out to them. First responders are now using new technology to speed up care and keep patients out of overcrowded hospitals. We're going to hook up with a doctor, FaceTime basically, and see if we could treat them at home. The doctor could call in prescriptions. Their mission is to keep our community safe and work as efficiently as possible, but recruiting new first responders has become difficult. A lot of times the public has their perception of us and we're just doing a job that we know needs to be catered to. But filling these positions can save lives or prevent crime. If you have the passion to help others, a dispatcher is a great way to do it. And also it can be a segue into a career in law enforcement if that's what you have a passion to do. It can really show you the ropes on what troopers do day in and day out. First responders say now is the time to apply as they work to build a stronger, safer community. In Baton Rouge, Jacqueline Kissick, Fox 44 News. Well, 